It's Barbara Borkart, and again we're in the studio, and this is the beginning of another painting. This painting is on paper, which tends to require less paint than canvas. It's lighter weight, and it doesn't have the tooth that a canvas sometimes can have, so it will hold less paint, and you tend to paint, I tend to paint, thinner and probably a little quicker on here. Anyway, this is um, a scene that I just saw the other day. The other, the other day, we had this terrific thunderstorm. The skies turned absolutely black, and uh, there was lightning and wind, and the color got to be very rich and very striking. And then all of a sudden, when I looked out the window across the harbor, there was a double rainbow. So I decided to document it because it's not that often that I see a double rainbow. And here it is. At least here's the beginning of it. Anyway, I've put the rainbows in. Up in here is the really dark sky. This is the blue that it should be. So the storm was coming and going out that way. And this is the harbor, which was quiet. The water was a very greeny, blackish blue because there was no light um, from up above. And this is the, the shadow that was coming across down in here, across the seagrass, and the brush, and the wetlands up in here. This is foliage in the back, and there'll be some houses and a lot of boats which will be showing up. Of course, across the harbor is a boat yard. And once um, the boat yard, well, now all the boats are in the water because it's summer, which means they'll appear over here. Anyway, this is the underneath part of the painting, and we're starting to put in some texture for the brush down in here. Some reflections of the water reflecting the light over there. Definitely not over here because it's too dark. And you can see all the different colors in the brush. It wasn't green, the light was so eerie, it was sort of goldish, rust kind of color. Same thing as the foliage in the background. There were very few green trees that you can see, and mostly it was down that way towards um, where the mass of boats are kept. Anyway, we'll see where we're going today. You can see this is a different kind of composition. I'm almost, I am parallel to the paper, which is kind of rare for me, but the rainbow sort of pull you in and up and over, so you can get this feeling of something's going on way out there. The light is coming in. So you can see that the light, which is coming from the rainbow, is actually affecting the foliage down at the bottom. It's changing the color of some of the trees in the background. What I've done is put in some buildings, some boats, and some different color foliage all along the back part of the harbor. This is the harbor in here. Um, the boats are moored along in here. They're starting to come in. And these are where the boats have been stored for the winter. Um, some are on cradles and they are lifted up and stacked one next to another, and possibly they are going in this year, possibly not. But this is how it looked during the double rainbow. And you can see the light is very different. It's really dark over here, and the storm is sort of leaving and going off that way, so there's more illumination in here, which is coming down this way, the shadows that the boats are throwing over in here. I'm going to put in today some bigger, taller masts, going up with some rolled sails, the masts along here, and there'll be some more boats moored along in here. So we'll see where we go today. 